Hello and welcome back to those sex mankind divided. In the last episode we finished side mission to look for Vincent Black. And I was um let me put disappointed. By the way, the mission finished. I was dissatisfied how it turned out to be. Um, but I read the wiki, I read about this quest and uh, there is not a lot of variation over there. Uh, but the theory w was proposed that Vincent uh, was uh, uh, well. It was not the lady that we helped uh, to escape that uh, gave out Vincent. It might have been some other lady who was also with the Dwalis. So. Might be some other way. The clockman's clock is ticking. Good one. Come on, let's blow this place. Hey, I'm the funny guy, not you. <laughs> Excuse me? Fuck off, will you get? I am not a big fan of Dwali presence here, I must say. Well, I mean, we've already been to this apartment and we know where the secret is. So let's just go straight in. Please meet me. To Alison. <clears throat> Dearest daughter, why are you avoiding me? When I first brought you home from the hospital, you were so happy. For the first time I thought you had finally found some peace. But now I'm frightened that those parasites you've fallen in with are corrupting you. I'm sorry, I know that they are your friends, but I just, I wish you wouldn't shut me out of your life. Please, I need to see you. Meet me? Even for a few minutes, just so I can see that you're okay, I'll get your favorite table at the Irish stool. You remember the spot downstairs? Alison, please come. Promise me, your loving father. I can't promise, but know that even though the paths we walk are forever faded to run parallel, I do love you, father. I can't escape that, it's not a problem. Smiley, Stanek wasn't at his apartment, but I did find what looked like bomb-making equipment. 
and a trap set by the Divine. You're kidding! I also found out where he might be. The Red Light District. At a bar across the street from the Red Queen. I'm heading there now. We have a couple of agents in that district watching the Diwali now. I'll send them over. Copy that. Science runs right oh, the 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 Over here! Who wants to get ahead? I have rights. You cannot detain me without charging me. This I know. And I know you're gonna sit there quietly and wait with us like a good little watchmaker. I've got this, Major Riley. You and your partner can relax for a few minutes. Wait a minute. I know you. You've been in my shop. What is this? You have some things to answer for, Mr. Stanek. We have evidence linking you and your shop to the train station bombing. Bombing? No! I would never... I, I wouldn't even know where to start. Y you have the wrong man! Well, I have the evidence. Do I? Convince me. I have a timing device with your name on it, and I found the tools to make even more bombs in your apartment. What else am I supposed to think? But you've been to my shop. You know I fix watches. I don't make bombs. No. Those tools aren't mine. They belong to my... Your daughter? No. No. Look. Take me in. I'm the one you're looking for, not her. I... I have made bombs for them. No, you did not. I don't think so. Protecting your daughter is admirable, Mr. Stanek. But you're not doing her any good by taking the blame. You need to tell me what you know. I... You're right, I know. Allison was in the military. She always wanted to belong, to be part of something greater than herself. She was such a beautiful child, gifted. What happened? After the incident, she met some people. They said they were her friends, but I could see they only wanted to use her. Parasites, and, and now, now, they have taken her. You must help! She is not to blame for this! She has been coerced! Calm down. What do you mean they've taken her? Allison and I were supposed to meet here tonight. Instead, one of them came by, spewing curses about fleshers and naturals. He gave me a message from her. She was... She was saying goodbye. But she would never... They used her, and now they intend to make her disappear! Does your daughter have the expertise to do this? Much more than I do. She was in the military. EOD, they called it. Explosive Ordnance Disposal. The bomb squad? Yes. She was happy in the military. They augmented her, rebuilt her to make her better at what she did. But after the incident, she was dishonorably discharged. Why? She was lost. Yeah, because That's of the incident. Her friends found her. Ugh. They exploited her, and now they plan to discard her. What do you know about these friends of hers? Other than they were augmented, not much. They only spoke to Allison when they came to the shop. As if anyone unaugmented was beneath them. They kept talking about the ascension. Whatever oh, that is it the church? Was it machine gun? Your apartment was booby-trapped by Radish Nikoladze. What? <coughs> Why would he... I guess friendship means nothing to a thug. What ship? I was never a wealthy man, but my shop is well known and respected. Reddish liked my watches. He knew I needed money after what happened to Allison, so we strike a deal. Deals are like beautiful women to that man. A better one always comes around. What kind of a deal? Where can I find hmm. Allison, Mr. Stanek? I wish I knew. I would go and get her away from those people. 
I was about to go looking for her when your goons showed up. We'll find her. I need you to go with these agents. I'll have some more questions for you. No! I have to go! I have to help her! She's... She's all I have! Please, let us do our job. Find my daughter, or I will! I doubt that, but... I mean, he will probably get himself Smile. just in I trouble. Stanek. He's not our guy, but he has a daughter. Allison, <coughs> ex-military EOD. She might be the lawmaker. So what's our next move? Stanek says he doesn't know where she is, but I think he's hiding something. The agents are bringing him in. Until he we'll gives her up, this investigation is stopped. I'll make sure they lean up. See what he knows. Good. Let me know what happens. Adam, Janus heard the NSN conversation we recovered. He agrees you two should meet. Good. Uh, just a rumor. There's an abandoned tourist information center in the central plaza. Make sure you're not followed. Like the question and I got something on Marchenko for you, too. You Details are on a pocket secretary near the meetup point. Look for a trash bin with a chalk mark above it. You'll find it near the metro. Got to it. that garbage. Cool. Who else will take care of it? Who would even listen to that crap? So, feels like it's going to rain. Trash bin with a chalk mark. Seems as though there are more police than usual. Here is what we know. Born 1991 near Zaporozhye, Ukraine. Uh, parents were illiterate railway workers, left school after 10 years, two years shy of the compulsory 12, to become a shift worker on a drilling gang looking for shale gas deposits in eastern Ukraine. Ran into trouble in 2011 when a group of pro-Russian separatists started a fight with his crew in Mariupol after work. He tried to break it up, got injured and ended up in hospital. Could have been when he got augmented, not sure. Records get pretty scarce here, in fact there is a good 12 year period we can't account for, and no record on, on, of when or where he did get augmented. Shows up again briefly in 2023, this time with a wife and newborn kid, Alisa Maratovna and Raisa Viktorichna. Only now he's in Belgorod, which I don't get frankly. A pro-Ukrainian national moving to Russia only makes sense if he stayed with energy companies all those years. Everyone wanted a piece of their reserves after 2015. But that would have been but that would have put him somewhere in Siberia, not Belgorod. Belgorod is on the border with Ukraine. It has nothing to do with oil. It does, however, have a long history of military occupation, and in 2016 it was, the, it was the city from which the newly minted Russian Federated States deployed both our associates to quell Ukraine's anti-separatist dissension once and for all. So why is he having a kid there in 2023? Still working on finding that one out, and on finding out what happened to the wife and kid afterward, because neither of them were with him when he emigrated to the Utule complex last year. Yeah, nowadays reading that kind of stuff is very... <laughs> have a very foreshadowing effect. Um, no, I did get there somehow otherwise. Yeah, here. My good old friend, ventilation shaft.
Janus. If this is your idea of a face-to-face -face meeting, I'm not impressed. You didn't think I would jump on a plane to Prague, did you? I guess not. The conversation we recovered. You know who Manderley was talking to, don't you? Robert Page, CEO of Page Industries and owner of the First Life Corporation. He's a multi-billionaire. Doesn't mean we can't arrest both of them for conspiracy to commit murder. We heard Page give the order to kill Rucker. In a recorded conversation that you obtained illegally. It's fruit from the poisonous tree, Mr. Jensen. It won't stand up in court. What about this orchid, then? Can we find out more about it? I think we should find out. I'm digging on my end, but there may be something you can do in Prague. First Life has an account at the Palisade Property Bank. If you can get to their data vault, we may find some of the answers we're looking for. You're telling me to break into a bank? Hey, you already did it. Mark is being manipulated, set up to take the fall for something. Most likely another terror attack. Fine. What about this Brown? Page mentioned him and some sort of council. Nathaniel Brown, maybe, head of the Santo Group? Perhaps. Nathaniel Brown stands to earn trillions if the Human Restoration Act passes, but... Janus. Adam, the site's been compromised. I just spotted sentry drones headed your way. What? How? I wasn't followed. Maybe somebody at PRE detected Janus' hack into the electrical grid. I don't know. Just get out of there. I don't like that one bit. But there are only drones, right? Yeah, only drones, but there are like three of them. With my amount of practice points, and I have 20, I mean, I told you that my borderline when I kind of think that I don't want to get any lower is, is 4. Yeah, the D-Way. The D-Way and probably the, the, the recharge rate. <clears throat> well, I might as well spend another four.
Okay, another question. Why do we go this way? Well, that would partially explain why would we go over there. How did you... My daughter. They're going to kill her. I gave your friends the slip, and when, when I got to here... Where? The Prakaska district. An apartment complex behind the laundromat. Please, hurry. Okay. What the hell? Adam, you okay? Those drones... I'm fine. Whoever sent them didn't succeed. Thank God for that. Listen, Janus just called. Versa Life is closing their account, moving everything out of that data vault tonight. This can't wait. You gotta get over there now. I can't. I found the bomb maker. She can tell us everything. But she's about to be killed. What? Shit, man. They're cleaning up Blue Sands. I can't break into a bank. Not by myself. And if we don't do this now, we lose the Orchid. Fuck! But if I don't go to the Prokowska district, the bomb maker dies, and we're back to square one. <sighs> Your call, man. Ah, oh, crap. Well, <clears throat> we are in the world of Deus X, where corporations screw people. So, I kind of have more curiosity to rob the bank, actually. Janus actually have a plan for this robbery? Or does he expect me to shoot my way to the vault? He had someone slip a package into the bank manager's car. Someone? It's parked in the employee parking garage. Let me know when you've got it. I'm glad you're doing this, Adam. Yeah, yeah. Can we just go already? It's late. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ludwig, you really need to fix your basement. This is awful. Don't tell me we have to search every car in here. Hmm? What? 
Why do you point me to the exit? I don't follow that. Okay, Alex, I got the package. Now what? There's supposed to be a data rod and an access card inside, but the card is blank. Jaina said we need to imprint it with biometrics from an active account holder. So what? Kidnap somebody and steal their DNA? <laughs> Maybe next week. Tonight we can get what's needed from an office on the third floor. According to a contact, the bank keeps Klein's profiles on a secure terminal there. So all I gotta do is get through security to find it. Great. I mean, that's not that difficult. Just got to be patient. <clears throat> now back to the bar. Four. <coughs> if I remember correctly, uh, Thomas gave us access to the third floor. Was that correct? Jensen, it's Smiley. Your friend, Nomad Stanek, escaped custody. Agent Riley said he was... Yeah, I heard. His daughter's in trouble. Trouble? What kind of trouble? You know where they are? Adam, you need to go find them, both of them, before it's too late. I'm on it. I'm on it, kinda. Mr. Jensen, you said you were coming. I got caught up in something. I'll be there soon, Mr. Stanek. There is no more soon. You are too late. My little girl is gone. She's gone to their ascension. Mr. Stanek. Nomad. Ah, shit. Here we go again. They do not have a panic room up there. They're just rarely in the office, and you're paranoid. Am I? This whole place is built on secret. How do you think Talbar and Doshiro really made their fortune? Why do you think anarchist hacker groups are always trying to crack into here? Because the most powerful companies in the world store their data here. Yeah, the stuff they don't want anyone to see. I pay big credits to be a fly on the wall during the Versailles visit. Why don't you earn those big credits by getting back to work? Okay. So far, so good. Yeah, damn it. <coughs> oh, never saw this thing before. Alex, you still with me? I'm accessing the biometric terminal now. How's this supposed to work? The way Janus explained it, malware on the card will look for the profile of an authorized Versalife representative and clone it. I thought he said the card was blank. Technically, I said it. Sorry. But the card should be active now. Find the elevator to the basement and try it. While we're here, we can also finish this part. Anomaly detected. Got them. Trace program initiated. Access 
access granted. <coughs> Security concerns. I appreciate your personal reply, Mr. Talwar, but still wish to impress my disappointment that we are even needing to talk about something like this. I won't repeat myself unnecessarily here, but have passed on your comments. We'll be sending representatives to your facility shortly and we'll discuss any potential collaboration once they arrive. Madam, in separate response to your recent concerns highlighting potential security issues and protocol failures connecting to your account, the Palisade Property Bank takes the feedback of its clients very seriously, especially one of your standing. External allegations that our security is compromised are patently false and already under rigorous investigation. Vodok problem. I've had someone look into our friend Bartosz. It seems this isn't the only thing he's been looking into and worse, divulging into the public. Apparently he has quite an underground persona on some anarchist site and has been hinting about insider trading. You know what I mean. I don't think we have any choice but to let him go. I'll have a private word with him before we leave. You should send out a carefully worded message to the other employees. Have you authorized Vodok to look into our automated systems that seems well outside his purview as executive services manager? I know you've, man you've made sure to scrub everything concerning the Seridakis incident, and I don't remember anything in Vodok's background check that should have thrown up a flag. But still, it worries me. I'll be sure to tell the designer you love her work, just remember that you were the muse. What was it I told her? Ah yes, a concept of two halves complementing the whole. When one fits the other, harmony is attained and so on. Joking aside, don't tell you how to solve. Didn't I tell you how to solve it already? R, T, R, T, T, R. You said you'd be okay remembering that. I love you despite your lack of artistic sensibilities. Hmm. RTR, TTR. As for this thing, right? I am joined by the head of the Department of Sociology at Harvard, Dr. Stansfield Christensen. It is a pleasure to speak with you, Doctor. Mr. Ashira, I have confirmed with officials from VersaLife they are adamant and will not cha change their itinerary. Is there perhaps any chance that you or Ms. Talwar will be returning to Prague early in order to be present for this surprise visit? If not, is there anything in particular you would like us to do? Um, can I close it back? No. Damn it. Access card worked, Alex. I'm in the elevator, heading down. Janus is good, man. He said security measures prevent wireless communications near the vault, so you and I will lose contact soon. Meaning I'll be on my own from here on in. Just until you enter the Versalife vault and plug the data rod into their terminal. Janus should be able to contact you directly once it's installed. He had me load a bunch of malware on it. Of course, you have to reach the vault access room and call down the Versalife vault first. If you're stopped by security... So I kind of want to wait them out. I don't want them all of a sudden to turn my way and just notice me out there in like 
in plain sight. Okay, one went to the right, another went to the left. Anomaly detected. Trace program initial access granted. Okay. What's over here? Oh, my friend. The ventilation shaft. It's dark as hell here. Ah, damn it. It has destructible ends. It lead me somewhere higher. Oh, there is a very touchy camera. And again. Mm. Why do you do this to me? I don't want to destroy any vents. Oh, I mean, then it's my problem, right? Yeah, but opening the door in front of the dude will be even more bad. I never asked for this. Did I save after I destroyed it? Man, just don't forget to look up. There was no need to... I destroyed the vent for no reason. Still offline. IT is running a final systems check before fully activating it. Better safe than sorry. Imagine the damage one of those ceiling mounted turrets could do if it malfunctioned. No danger of that. Both Yanisek and Mr. Oshiro have overview on the auto systems. Hmm. Didn't help that engineer. What? A few years back? An engineer. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Better get back to it or we'll get ours. Access granted. A bias cell. What would I use bias cell for? No. No clients. Confirmed. Updated. As you were. Okay, some server room. Yeah, which is apparently closed off, so... I think we can safely descend here. And have a look into this computer. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Granted. Yeah, we have some cameras, but those are known, so... Is my 
I don't see anything particularly interesting over here. Now oh, there is this cable duct. Oh, okay, I can drop down here. Move okay. Confirm. Confirm. As you were. I can drop down and immediately on them as well. And somewhere over here. All systems function. Confirmed. Check updated. I'd rather have something around here so that I can sneak my way to this cable duct. shaft. That's the first. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. For some reason I thought there is a connection. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. No, oh, that's much better. <coughs> no, I don't see... Anything? But it looks like we reached the vault. Coolio. Just in case somehow you can hear me, I'm about to call down the Versalite vault, Alex. Yo, damn. I have a lot of stuff in here, apparently. Now, before I press the big red button, I want to know the layout. Yeah, if anything, I can hide over here. That is nice to know. Wait. Thank you. Janus, can you hear me? Yes. The link is weak, but I can strengthen it. Wait, what are you doing? The data rod contains a secret program. It's flagging everything it finds on Project Orchid and sending it to me. Wait, wait, that's an audio file. Can I hear it? Hello? Bob. It's Megan. 
Those orchid samples you told my new assistant to send to Switzerland? I asked him not to bother you with that. It's okay. I told him he could. But it's just... I've never heard of this garden facility before. A recent acquisition. I'll have to take you there someday. That's not necessary. Listen, the changes we made to the orchids calves enzymes, they're incredibly dangerous. Until we perfect the replacement base fragment, GARM's researchers must keep a neutralizing enzyme on hand. I've read your reports, Mayden. I know all about the failures of the CRISPR molecule. I'm even keeping a sample of the neutralizer inside a secure vault in case your research gets corrupted. You are? Trust me, you have nothing to worry about. Thank you. I just wanted to be sure this time. Good night, Bob. Good night, my dear. Megan Reed and Bob Page. Megan. Dr. Reed, you seem disappointed. She joined VersaLife shortly before Seraph Industries closed. I assumed you knew. I don't suppose you know anything about this facility in Switzerland. Garm, I've been digging into it ever since your ex said the name. It was a geological research center until 2025, when Bell Tower Associates bought it. They didn't list it on their balance sheet when they filed for bankruptcy. Yeah. I guess they also forgot to mention the spec ops unit that went AWOL. I have to get to Garm. What are you thinking? I'm thinking about the augmented mercs who ambushed us in Dubai. If Paige sent them the orchid. That's everything. Unless they're storing something physical in there. Either way, I suggest you leave soon. With the vault in that position, you should be able to exit through the shaft. Good luck, Mr. Jensen. And please don't forget the data rod when you leave. Well, a little bit of stealing for my troubles. AJ090921 patient X. Should be me. DNA analysis of sample taken shows unusually high presence of mutagenic chemicals in the primary strand. These don't appear to be harmful, however. In fact, X appears to be healthier and more resilient to infection than most subjects of a similar age and ethnic background, although admittedly this is based on personal observation only. Access to access medical files and history is not possible at this time. More interesting to note, however, is what these chemicals do when isolated and introduced to the peated cluster. In less than 24 hours, artificial materials within the cluster have been completely encapsulated in a thick, semi-permeable coating of subject's own neural tissue. In effect, the invaders are being disguised as part of subject's nervous system. Yeah, I think we read it in the previous game. Can I read uh, the secretary, please? Yep. Colin, thank you again for making the trip. Palisade execs will be waiting for you. Everything has been set up for your visit to our company vault. You might find some interesting data in there. The code to the computer is uh, in case you need to access it. You may as well leave this pocket secretary in there for the next time. 5896KLM O one B N King Bob and M G Reed. Megan, you there? Hi Bob, I was just talking about you. Good things, I hope. Chatting with Gary. Of course, good. He's seen some great results in the last twelve months with the gene strain. I didn't get the details, of course, it's very hush hush about these things. I'm sure he'll fill me in. Progress on Orchid? Promising. Latest results show almost no CM buildup, which indicates uh, less glial interference. Uh, what about the mutability problem? Still struggling with that, but we have the inside track on a neutralizing agent, taking advantage of its binary nature. Wonderful. Congratulations. 
We are all very excited. Certainly makes working with this thing less stressful. Good, I will let you get back to it. Thanks, Bob. See you soon. HK Pi. From Everett to Bob. Morgan Everett. Okay. Why is she shutting me out? I need access to that site. She's not shutting you out, she's just being careful. The eyes of the world are still watching. Which is exactly why I need access. We have equipment down there. Sensitive equipment. It needs to be recovered before the ocean completely destroys it. I know. Trust me. I just helped Bell Tower get rid of the same thing from your other underwater lab. Lucius put Elizabeth in charge of this one. Her position at the World Health Organization makes it easier. She'll send you everything she recovers as soon as it is safe enough to do so. We need to move carefully, Bob, now more than ever. Mr. Page, the Shackleton facility is almost ready for full operation and everything has been laid out according to your specifications. All the equipment has been moved in, minus a few incidental incidentals. One of the incubators was broken in transit. Living quarters are fully stocked as well. Personnel are scheduled for transfer next week. Will you be wanting to brief them in person? We are experiencing some issues with the transfer of experiments from New Mexico, specifically the bovine manipulation project. It may be prudent to wait until a later date, but I will leave the final decision up to you. Okay. Some weird stuff is going on. Nice. Oh, well, that is very Janus, can you hear me? Helpful. I think I found that neutralizing enzyme Megan and Paige were talking about. We don't have a lot of time, Mr. Jensen. We'll lose contact. No problem, I got this one. I might be able to save a life or two with this if the orchid shows up again. Oh. Time to make myself scars, I guess. Not entirely sure though, how do I get out? But let's have a look. Like, what's this thing? Yeah, that's a familiar location now. Okay. Now just quietly make our way out of here. And we should be good.
so we need to wait when the dude goes away or at least turns away that also works for me Yeah, that was not the best approach. Yeah, but we are out. And these are very good news. We cleaned out the last vault that was accessible to us in the bank. And we found an, uh, a, neut a neutralizing agent. Yeah, sorry for that. Yeah, well, I escaped from it. Reminds me of a movie I once saw. Where? Why would I go here? Why? Miller, it's Jensen. I've got a lead on the augmented mercs who ambushed us in Dubai. You're supposed to be investigating the train station attack. Just hear me out. There's a research facility. Not like this, you don't. I'm en route to Prague now. She'll be landing at Chicane's helipad any minute. I'll hear you out there. Miller out. City has gone to hell. Let's keep up. Jensen, you still got that calibrator on you? If you do, man, I'm ready to optimize that crazy system of yours. I got everything oh, I need yeah. to fix you up real good. You mean the way you fixed me up last time? No, no, no. This is gonna be different, huh? On Vaclav's honor. Just get to the lab and you'll see. So let's get super augmented, I guess. Let's call it this way. Perhaps there will also be a chance to check up on uh, um, Stanek's daughter, Ellison. That was her name. Is there such a chance? I just heard what happened. God, right outside your apartment? What happened outside my apartment? Someone got all their implants torn out. Was left to bleed to death in the alley. When I first heard where it was, I thought... I'm fine, Aria. It wasn't me. Be careful going home. It's not the first one of these I've heard about. So there was another murder crime thing. This can't be happening to me. Right outside my apartment, you say? You're joking, right? I'm telling you right now. I'm open. I'm here now. Fucking can't feel my toes, man. Okay, then you think Polta Sunda Knepsek. Living like this. Take a good look. I won't be here long. Biocells, painkillers, right over there.
I'm confused. Yes, I'm very confused. God, help my skin. The gentle chair, hey. Eh? Let's hope it will be more gentle than the last time. Shit. Did you hear? Talos Rucker's dead. I witnessed that. I heard that somewhere, yeah. Yeah. Pretty cool, right? Now we can get some real progress. He was making us look like wimps. That's a little harsh, isn't it? Rucker didn't deserve what happened to him. Something tells me our politics aren't the same, Jensen. Me, I think this whole martyr thing is exactly what we need. But, um, let's maybe focus on things we can agree on, huh? Like optimizing that uh, crazy rig of yours. Yes. You got a calibrator for me or what? Yes. You really think Rucker was the problem? That his death is somehow gonna make things better for Augs? I don't think he was the solution. We need a new leader. Someone a little less beardy, make fancy diploma. Someone who's gonna fight, you know? Stand up to some of these bullshit laws. You hear about the Human Restoration Act? Yeah. If the restoration vote passes, I don't know that it's gonna matter very much who the leader is. It's gonna be a government-mandated horror show is what it's gonna be. Men in white coats pulling out augmentations like they are teeth. <sighs> anyway, speaking of medical horrors, you ready for me to fix you or what? This procedure. There won't be any surprises like last time. Last time I was surprised by your crazy tech, but now is totally different. Now I know what's under that hood of yours, and you got me the tool I need. Changes everything. So what are you gonna well, do? Oh, that sounds that promising. I'm gonna optimize your system. No more worrying about overheating. No more worrying about glitches. Jensen 2.0. Sounds pretty good. You know, this is interesting being how conservative I am in terms of spending proxies points. Me being excited about having the possibility to pick up new augmentations. Hm. Alright. Please tell me this is what a neuroplasticity calibrator looks like. That's the one! Okay, this won't take long, I promise. And don't worry, man, I never screw up two in a row. Spent a lot of time prepping for this one. Just try not to take anything. That wasn't so bad, right? How do you feel? I feel fine. I feel lighter. I fixed you. Death to all your limits. Whatever implant you want to activate, you activate. Zero consequences. That sounds, sounds dangerous. <laughs> Thanks, okay. Kohler. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get out there and make me proud. 
Go make use of all that cool shit. Well, the coolest shit is uh, remote hacking. That one is really cool. Okay, but I think it is high time to wrap up the episode here. It was a nice one. Uh, we completely heisted the bank, if I can say it like this. Um, we cleared out first life vault, we found some, uh, well, it looks like an antidote thing. And uh, given that I don't like poison, not a, be not a big fan of being poisoned, or gassed, or whatever, I like having this stuff on me. Um, Milder's Beast, but understandable, because we basically um, skipped his uh, order, we were assigned another case, and we kind of screwed that, and decided to follow our own, more well, the task that is more interesting for us, so uh, his anger can be understood. However, that doesn't mean that I will receive a pattern ahead. But we'll check that out later. For now, thank you for staying with me. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay and was not distracted too much by uh, me occasionally switching off my mic and uh, uh, doing some mutant stuff. Um, if you like the gameplay, if you like my commentary, please put a like and subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, let me know down in the comments what I can improve for you. And I hope to see you next time. Have a nice day out there. And bye.